In Malaysia, as the year-end blessing ceremony organized by the Tsiji Kuala Lumpur and Selangor chapter is fast approaching, for elderly volunteers, memorizing the entire sutra performance can be difficult. Therefore, they brought in technology to help them overcome their troubles. It goes to show that one is never too old to learn. As the annual year-end blessing ceremony is just around the corner, city volunteers utilize their spare time at the recycling station to master the complexity of the sign language. For many, however, it is quite a struggle. We all have to face the consequences of cause and effect, and it's a heavy price to pay. It's very heavy. We cannot run from it. A verse in the Buddhist scripture reminded 56-year-old Zhang Mei of her parents' grace. When we were little, my parents always kept food for us to eat without eating themselves. Now I have enough food on my plate and I have a good life. So thinking back on the days of my parents' hardship really saddens me. Without them, there would be no me. I still don't believe I can do this, but Sister Minghui encouraged me. She told me that I can. With encouragement, Grandma Hui Ying agreed to take part in the sutra performance. Being 72 years old does not deter her determination to learn. To conquer the complex moves of the sign language, she turned to technology. I asked Sister Minghui to show me the sign language actions and I recorded them with my tablet so I can rehearse at home and because I'm illiterate I will write the phonetics next to the words. I like signing a lot and now that I have recorded the actions I can rehearse everywhere I go. The underlying meaning of the Sutra scripture is deeply imprinted in these senior volunteers' hearts and their determination to learn makes them young at heart.